Living or dying, we are God's. Romans chapter 14 and verse 8. If we live, it's to honor the Lord. And if we die, it's to honor the Lord. So whether we live or die, we belong to the Lord. Belongingness is part of the theory of hierarchy. Abraham Maslow proposed the idea of belonging as an emotional need of the human beings. Once people's basic physiological and safety needs are met, they look for the sense of being part of someone or some group. It is the natural need to express emotion in an acceptable environment. Maslow propounded the theory in the early 90s, but Jesus addressed the need to belong long ago before any psychological theory evolved. Paul understood the idea of Jesus and therefore he was writing to the church at Rome, explaining the need to belong and know where they actually belonged. He said those who have received Jesus, whether they were dead or alive, they belonged to him, and Jesus belonged to God the Father. Paul had to be so specific in describing it since those who received Jesus were not just the circumcised Jews, it included even the uncircumcised Gentiles. In general, people have this attitude of affinity towards their own clan or ethnic groups. In India, the discrimination is so much that it often leads people to be baited and separated based on these ethnic backgrounds. The wicked people use this difference to their personal gain and cause rift among the innocent. They instigate them for strife and quarrel. Paul was helping people to evade this idea of discrimination and the gospel of Christ teaches that he is not partial and neither will God show favoritism. Paul deliberately shared that if they belong to Christ, there would be no discrimination or prejudice. Whether live or dead, they would belong to Christ. It was a blessed hope of all who take Jesus as their personal God. Living or dying, we are God's. God bless you.